slides back. Racing makes the catch. Warning track power. A player new to his double A squad gets a tip from one of his coaches. Oh shit, I'm pitching again, baby. Yo guys, and <sighs> Yo guys and gals, it's your favorite thunder for daughter. What's up? Every uh buddy. What's going on you guys? We're playing some more MLB the show twenty two road to the show. Thunder's road to the show. And we had great outings in our last session of uh, streams. Hopefully we can get some great outings in this session of streams. The intros are going to be weird, so. Minor league baseball from the double A level coming up. It's the Binghamton Rumble Ponies and the Portland Sea Dogs. We should have a beat the Sea Dogs. Three to eleven, and we're pitching. On the hill, the big righty, Brian Keller. Yeah, bro, he put on a clinic his last time out. Strikeouts just seemed like every other hitter was walking back to the dugout. We'll see if that's the case again in this one. The 0-1. Not the best swing that time from the first round pick. And get pooped on. Oh. And one and two. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Little, little early on that. He's a fighter. The one two. Hammer, base well, we could so retire to side. To the oh, I'm sure he feels really good about that one. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Next pitch misses. And that's ball one. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. So now Ooh. one and two. You know, there's a certain point where you have to commit to what you think you see, and he guessed wrong right there. Nasty slider with just terrific bite at the end. You now this pitching staff has been merciless against him in this one. I mean, he struck out six times in this series, and we've seen no adjustment out of him so far. Pour it on him. Yeah, there's a ball. Fuck there that. A that's a strike. There? I think there was. Yeah. A little slider action. Swing and a miss. That is strike two. Meyer at first, one gone. Stays alive. Next pitch just misses. Two and two. And that one fouled off. Pitch. Runner takes off. Pitch misses inside. Throw to second. He's safe. Well, a nice lead and a nice steal there to get in the scoring position with the heart of the order at the plate. That might just lead them to. God the damn, runners. man. There's a little more because of the open base, but it's early in this ball game. Can't imagine it'll change the attack plan too much. Man, that's a tough one to take on the full count, but I guess he saw it really well. It's a really nice plate appearance. Next offering is fouled back. Inside. Oh my god, this is the worst Eddie start of mankind. Eddie hit him. Oh my god, 0-2 and corner, hit the fucker, and man. Sure starting to feel the pressure right now. We'll see if he can bear down and get out of this one. Cameron Cannon watches that one go just below the knees for a ball. I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. Now that's smack to right center. He's got it. Here comes the runner from third. And they'll score first. It's one zip. So first and second with two outs. Now it's the right fielder, Nick Decker. In there and it's 0-1. 
It's great to get on the board in the first frame of the ball game, but here's an opportunity for them to really open things up with a couple of runners on. Let's see if they can cash in. First and second, two down. He swings and fouls one off. That fastball at the bottom of the zone can be very effective. Just got to keep it on the corners. Next pitch inside. Now one and two. Left-hand hitter waits. Just off the inside edge. Come on, just get retired already. Man. And it's filled up. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Fucking walk the guy, let off a hit. Fucking. Now at the plate, Brandon Howley. Man. And a pitch. And fouled off. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Bounce to the left side. And quickly one away in the second. There we go. So up next, Roldani Baldwin. First pitch, just misses. Next offering is in for a strike. Painted that outside corner. Swings and misses. And a count. One and two. And down on strikes he goes. And there's two away. There we go. And he'll be beating himself up on the way back to the dugout. Got a pitch to hit and just couldn't get to it. I think that slider really caught way more of the plate than it was supposed to. And now it's Hudson Potts. Here's a guy who's been struggling so far this year. It's only late April, but still hoping he'll turn it around soon. Here we go. And the righty deals. Backed off the plate that time. Damn it. Misses the zone. Two balls and a strike. Pretty easy to give up on that pitch right there. Started on the edge of the plate with the spin. You know it's going to finish well off the plate. Two outs. Swing and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. And that turns the lineup over. That's about as textbook as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball. That one ripped. And it's oh, my God. Ball. Worst start ever, dude. Lead runner gets the stop side. This is the worst start I've ever done. Second and third now. So two down. Tyler McDonough now at the plate. Nice double right there. Loud contact coming off the bat. Didn't get enough air under to drive it out of here, but you'll take that swing and that result every time. Oh, and two as he waves at that one. Yeah, I'm surprised we didn't see a visit from the pitching coach here. Just to remind him, focus on. Now that's strike three and the third out. So we take a break. Back here at the ballpark. And now the first baseman, number 23. The pitch. That's a strike. So important for Need a decent inning here. Right now, he's got to go through the heart of this lineup. Checks his swing, appeal to third, and that's going to be ruled a swing. Here's the 0-2. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. One gone here. Whew. Dominating strike out there on just three pitches, and that's what a good power pitcher can do to you. If he's hitting his spots, filling up the strike zone, sometimes he bats over before it really begins. At the play, number 24. And first offering is fouled off. Here we go, guys. Kicks and deals. And that one pulled foul. Next offering is foul back. Foul it back. Going two now. That one missing inside. One down, one down. And now the count. That's a That's a strike, umpire. And a foul ball, he stays alive. 
Righty delivers. Stays alive. Good battle here. About to be the eighth pitch of the at-bat. The punch out there. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. That right there is one of those breaking balls that you swing through and you feel like you should have done something with it or at least spoiled it away. But there we go. In on you like that, there we go. Is tight enough, it can actually yeah, tie you yeah. up. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. Hey, plays it first. Plays it first. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. The big righty strikes out the side. There, that was a better three. That was a better third inning. And welcome back. And now the right fielder, Nick Decker. Swing and a miss. That's strike one. Oh, and two now. Swing and a miss. There we go. Get in the groove now. Get in the groove now. Came out of his mechanics there. Typically likes to shoot the ball the other way. But that time, a little anxious. So digging in, Brandon Howlett. He's 0 for 1. And first offering is fouled off. The pitch. And that skips in the dirt. Next offering is fouled back. Fouled it back. One down, one down. Well, you put good velocity in the head of the hitter. He's got to get it ready early and then change speeds. Keep him off balance. That's the goal. Sit down, son. And he's down on strikes. That's the second out. With that kind of velocity, an elevated fastball, even if it's still in the strike zone, can be tough for hitters to get on top of. Now the catcher up to hit, Roldani Baldwin. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Next one misses, ball two. And a pitch. That one fouled off. And a pitch. That one fouled off. Two and two. Next offering is fouled back. And there's a foul. Oh my ball. God, he's fouled pitches off. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Five foul balls in a row. I have no idea what that feels like, but you gotta love this battle. Just wondering who's gonna blink first. That's a hit, and that keeps the inning going. Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. Worked himself into a good count. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a There line. we go. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Next offering is foul back. Lifted in the air, right center field. Number 11 sizes this one up, makes the grab on the run. And that will it. Yancy Diaz on a pitch here. This is his fifth appearance of the year. 7-3 is how this one ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MF. Yeah, that first inning sucked. I threw 12 pitches. Or 22 pitches. He's getting some great results on the mound early in his pro career, and people around the game are taking notice. One of those people is Jonathan Mayo of MLB Pipeline, who joins me now. Jonathan, what are you seeing when you look at him out there on the mound? Uh, there's nothing more exciting than seeing a guy going from the amateur game to the pro game and hitting the ground running. He's really taken to the pro instruction. You've seen all of his stuff take a step forward uh, in, in the way he's using his pitches. He works quickly. He throws a lot of strikes. The command has really gotten much better. And as a result, the players behind him love it because they're ready to go on each and every pitch. There's not a lot of wasted time. Uh, the development he's already made in such a short period of time has a big up arrow next to his name.
So far we're up to 58 overall. Nine and six so far in our uh, season. Not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Welcome to the Welcome to the minor league ball so players. Now on the hill here today, Matthew Allen. Boogie pitched into the seventh, earned the W in his last start. He really needed that one. Well, this team needs another one today. We'll see if he can carry that performance into this game. They take the force out. That's out number three. So it's on. There we go. So two down now, and here is Eric Carter. He's hitting for that pop. Came out of the gates really strong. That's the third. <sighs> Tosses to first, and that'll do it. End of one. No speed. Man at first, and next will be the cleanup hitter, Gage Workman. Here's a guy who's been struggling so far this year. It's only late April, but still hoping he'll turn it around soon. <laughs> Out number three. So they pick up a run on. No errors in a man. Eric Carter getting ready to hit. That's out to center field. De La Cruz on the move as he glides back. Racing makes the catch. Warning track power. Now it's going to be Eric Carter. It's been such a good hitter with runners in scoring position. Some guys just take it to another level. For him right now at the plate, it's like everyone else is in slow motion and he's in full speed. And that one is lifted in the Damn, air. man. No trouble here. Puts it away for the. So up next, Eric Carter. Can't do shit. Good. Up there. Uh, the oh for four. Lose the eighth great eighth game. Eight game hitting streak comes to an end. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. That's unfortunate. And welcome. Eric Carter digs in now. Hitless and four at bats yesterday. Rips one to right. There we go. And that extends the inning. First pitch swing in, went up there with the plan to be aggressive. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trust So digging in, number 30. Number 30. Bunting for a hit. Fun attempt doesn't work. They get the out. Whew. Now the third baseman, Eric Carter. Now the third baseman, Eric Carter. And there's something you don't see very much in today's game, the pitch out. Come on, big guy. One time. Here you go. Hard ground ball hey, base right now. There we go. Nice little poke there. So first and second now, one out. All over that one right there. I know that was a ground ball, but it was absolutely hammered through the infield. That's not one you're excited to get in front of if you're an So one out, nobody on. Here's the third baseman, Eric Carter. The third baseman, Eric Carter. Swing and a high fly ball down the right field line. Makes the oh. grab, and there's two gone. Well, on the mound, very efficient. Able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth pit. One out, base is empty. Eric Carter, the next to hit. Now, the third baseman. Eric. now fly ball to right center. Makes the grab on the run. Damn. Two down. 
Welcome back. New inning getting started. Here's the second baseman, number 91. Trying to bunt his way on. And he beats it. He's safe. Well, a seven-out save in this one. It's far from your standard save, but he did what was necessary to help his team get the win and see a guy pitch. Didn't do game. shit that game. Inspiring for other guys down in the bullpen. Mm -hmm. Got a few hits. Now the third baseman, Eric Carter. Foul ball there. Hey, come on now. One time, right here. And he deals. Popped up. Ah. Number 91 in position. <laughs> Squeezes it. Pop it up, pop down. it up. So up next. <laughs> Should be like, I love every pop up out. No! No! God, no! <laughs> and a 3 2. Trying to move him over here. Carter. The throw to first. The runners move up on the sacrifice. Now the left fielder, Daniel Cabrera. The wind of the pitch. Rolled over to third. Throws to first, and there are two outs. Here's the third baseman, Eric Carter. Eric Carter. Out towards right center field. It falls in, and that's a base hit. Yay. Got a hit. Now the third baseman, Daniel Pinero. Turn in two. On the ground, could be two. Off balance feed, there's one. And that's quick work out of the pen. One batter. One batter, two gone. Hit in the air, right field. Woodrow makes the catch, and that'll do it. And we lose again. Carter now at the plate. Now batting, third baseman, Aaron Carter. Woo! Cracked out a home run. And three RBIs as well. Just about to get underway. Getting the nod in this one, Jose Buto. What do you have on him, Siggy? Well, he tried to make it through the fifth inning last time out, but the pitch count just got too high. He ended up taking the loss. <coughs> it's one of those you just have to shake it off, come back out today, and try to throw a gem. Peterson gloves it. Gets it to first. That's one out in the bottom of the second. 
back here at the ballpark, bottom of the inning, and now the DH, Eric Carter. Out to short. That was a nice play. And the leadoff man nice play. The and welcome back. Now it's the DH, Eric Carter. The line of the pitch. Whoa, that went out. <laughs> One for three. Up the middle, dives, but it kicks off his glove. That leaves him without a throw, and they don't get the out. Another multi-hit game for him. He's been really hot lately. Now the base is loaded. Big opportunity for him. Roll a ton of hits in this one, but the sequencing just not on point to be able to put runs up on the board. Real close game. Saw a lot of offense, but it just didn't translate. So many Doing runners left good. in scoring position. So many missed opportunities.